Mama Pika and her infant have spent a year in a cage waiting for this moment. A year Lona spent finding this safe area of forest and organising their return to the wild. It's a lot of time, it's a lot of money investing in a wild animal, but on the other hand, I mean, I, I think they're worth every single dollar that we put into it. Um, I don't think you can put a price on an animal that's going extinct. I don't think you can sort of say it's not worth it. For us, getting to the end of th this, this road is like, it's so wonderful. It's, it's probably one of the mo most wonderful feelings that a human can experience, I think. It's a sort of love in many ways so to these animals. You know, it's like giving them back what they deserve. With her traumatic time in captivity behind her, Baby Pika now stands a chance of living the natural life she should. Over the next two days, all 25 orangutans will be released in this river basin. Like Mustapo and Baby Pika, every one is being given back the freedom that humans had taken from them. Every single orangutan here that we're releasing now we actually say from being killed. For us, getting them out and seeing them just take off into the trees, it makes me feel very, very happy. It's probably the best feeling in the world. They'll spread out, they'll find their, their own little territories and, and, and settle down and become real orangutans again. It's just been a fantastic um, experience uh, this time. Took a lot of planning, but you know, it's, it's gone really well. I think the best thing is probably seeing this fantastic forest here along the Banana River. I've flown over it, it looked absolutely wonderful, but sitting here is just saying, thinking, you know, this is probably you know, the most fantastic spot for the orangutans to be released. Oh, and after this is, um, it's back to the center again, where we've had, just before I left, just in the last two days, we had seven more wrangle tanks coming in. It really is a never ending job. Despite all her efforts, orangutans arrive at the center faster than Lona can release them. Time really is running out for the entire species. It's been predicted that in just 13 years, only 2% of the orangutan's Indonesian forests could remain.